right, good afternoon everybody. And it's 4th of July weekend and we're headed to Shawnee State Park. And even though there's no fireworks on the lake this year, we're gonna bring them to you. So here you go. So, but seriously, friends, uh, we're headed to Shawnee State Park this weekend for 4th of July, and um, we are quite disappointed that they canceled the fireworks. Uh, Rachel and I went a couple years ago, and it was a really cool experience, and that's pretty much why we booked this site. Um, but we're still pretty excited to go. Uh, this is our favorite site at Shawnee State Park, or, or one of them in a really nice area, and um, we're going to kayak around the lake and maybe do some swimming at the lake and you know normal campfire stuff but uh, this is our first tow with the new ram and uh, you know it's only well, we've only gone 20 miles so far but uh, it's a short tow and I can't really tell you much about how the ram tows because ram doesn't want you to drive very fast for the first 500 miles that you tow so I'm kind of taking it easy with the truck but uh, we're hoping to break it in properly and then uh, give you some good feedback about how it tows once we can get on it a little bit. So friends, they're working on the bridge currently that uh, leads to the campground, so that's why we came in a different way. If you've ever been here before, normally you'll go into the state park and then uh, there's a bridge that takes you back over 96. And that's this is our new setup, parked on fairly level ground. And uh, it looks to me like the trailer sits pretty level and the truck looks like it's sitting perfectly so I think we're gonna leave the weight distribution hitch how I have it now all right friends this is our site we're grilling some pork chops for dinner this is the first day we're here and uh, we told you this is absolutely our favorite site here at Shawnee. You, uh, you get a little bit of a view of the campground, but for the most part, there's not a lot of other people around. So it's a, it's a nice balance of everything. Here's the old new truck in the background, hopefully. And this is the maiden voyage for our Challenger and playful kayaks. basically given my parents the fiberglass kayaks that we had before. We weren't really sure how to take them with us when we went. We used to put them in the trailer. It's kind of an inconvenience. So we went with inflatables. And if we decide to go back to fiberglass, well, at least we know where they're at.
If anybody knows what that is, let me know in the comments. I'm assuming it was a herring of some kind, but I've only ever seen the blue ones, and that one was pure white. It's a very pretty bird. <laughs> Day two of our time here at Shawnee, it's Saturday, and uh, we're going to go do some kayaking. Um, so far, you know, for the campground being so booked, it really hasn't been a huge hindrance. Uh, you guys know we don't particularly prefer crowds, but it uh, really hasn't been a big issue. Um, I don't know if it's because our site is so nice and private back here, but it's been good. Sarah's been enjoying the hammock. Say hi. Hi. Looks like Sarah's trying to tip the boat again. Sticking her arms down in the water. I gotta say, I much prefer the single kayak to the double kayak. It's a lot easier to handle. I don't know if that's because there's a squirmy two-year-old in the double or if it's just more unwieldy. That's the lakeshore trail there, part of it. It goes clear around the lake. It's 3.1 miles. We've biked it and we've walked it. It's a nice trail. It's not, it's a really easy trail. It's a baby turtle. Hard to see. I can't tell if there's a turtle on that log up there or not. Turtle. What are you doing? A swing it so you need to swing me. I need to swing you? Yeah. So friends, good morning. It's Sunday, it's our last day here at Shawnee. And uh, we're doing a little bit of kayaking. And, um, but we wanted to tell you last night, normally here at Shawnee, they do fireworks on the lake, which is a really cool experience if they ever get back to doing it. You should definitely do it. You can kayak out on the lake and they shoot the fireworks out right over top of you. But for whatever reason, uh, it was canceled for this year as well as last year. But uh, we decided to go up to Blue Knob, uh, not to the state park, but to the resort, which they're right next to each other. And uh, they had what they call the Red, White, and Blue Knob Festival. And it was pretty cool. They had an 80s rock cover band there and uh, some real good food. And they also did a short fireworks segment, which is really cool because, you know, we wanted to try to get to see fireworks. We wanted Sarah to experience the fireworks. And so 
even though we couldn't see them from the kayak, we still got to see fireworks, and we still got to kayak while we were here. So, really all in all, it's been a great weekend. One of the things that we've learned from watching KYD, and Mark and Trish are big on this, is to focus on what you can do and not what you can't. So, you know, our focus really has been on the things that we could do this weekend, even though the things we reserved this site for and the things we wanted to do were not available to us. The, up, the other takeaway from this trip is don't be afraid to go camping on a holiday weekend. Uh, there, you always see all these horror stories about crowds and rowdy people and stuff, but that really has not been our experience at all this weekend. Um, it's been quite quiet. I mean, there's people in every site, don't get me wrong. Um, but, like, you know how we are about crowds if you've watched our previous episodes. And uh, really, it's been a good experience. As, and we've got to kayak all three days and um, test out the new inflatables, which was a goal of ours for this trip. And uh, so really, it's just been a real positive experience and a real positive weekend. And uh, so I'm going to hand the GoPro over to Rachel and um, talk to you on the way out. Did you have a fun weekend? Yeah. Did you enjoy yourself? Yeah. You're gonna come back to Shawnee? Yeah. Okay. We had an excellent weekend. Most people, I guess, observed the holiday on the, the Monday following the weekend, but I have to work tomorrow, so that's why we're leaving on Sunday. But uh, it was still a really nice weekend, really nice refreshing weekend. So we just wanna encourage everybody to get out and explore get out and do things and uh, it's, it's good for you. Mm -hmm.